about to be bowled. Jason Holder. Very... Wits gone. Great catch. Superb start for the West Indies. Jesse Ryder. His hands at the ball hard. Trying to pierce that gap in the point. He hit it in the air. And a good catch by the West Indian fielder. Rampal's done the damage straight away. Oh, it's an LBW appeal. It is out. It's nipped back. And Guptill knows it straight away. Just watch. Scenes back a long way. Guptill played the line. Benefit of bowling a full length. Oh, beauty. Absolute beauty. Taylor goes high in the air. It'll clear mid on. Won't go for four, though. It's pitched and stopped. Full little inside edge on that. Oh, don't want one. Go. Oh, brilliant from Holder. Absolutely brilliant from Holder. And Taylor's gone. In some ways, isn't that the way Ross Taylor in the form of his life? A great throw, though. To make him go. Straight back down the ground. A little bit aerial. And Cullum is underway with a couple. There he goes. Is this the first boundary? Yes, it is. And is it all the way? Oh, has he hit this one well enough for six? It's flair! It's over the top of the man, is it? Yes, it is. Heavens to... Wow, this was flat and hard from McCullum. Tried to roll the wrist, which has kept it down. And just over top. Oh, it's a beauty. And he's had it. He's nicked it. Williamson tried to make out. He had it. But he has to go. And Kane Williamson's good enough to get an outside edge. Yep, some away movement. Williamson's looking to play onside. And he still manages to find it. It's a ripper, is it taking the glove? It caught something all the way through. The West Indies are adamant. That's well played. That's well played, Greg McMillan. That's four. Oh. And the bowler will support that field with a beauty. Got it. Got it. And should have got it for four. It'll tease the fields, but the boundary's too short down there. Anderson. That'll go through all the way as well. It's not the quickest outfield because there's been rain around, but that had enough. Oh, I know if he's got this, he hasn't at all. Simmons should have it, he has. Oh, no timing there, and Bravo has struck through in his first over. You hit the right length on this surface with the bounce that there is. It's hard to hit the ball straight. The straight boundaries are inviting, but you'll see that. Oh, good shot. Beautifully struck, Ronke. Well, this is out too. Straight down the barrel. He's had it straight down his throat. Ronke can't believe it. He stands mid-pitch, hand on hip. Lorraine, he'll feel that is probably one he got away with because there are only two feelers leg side. This man here, Johnson Charles at the backward square. Yes. Edge, yes indeed, or is it off the pad? He's been given. Thinks it's off the pad. I thought there was enough doubt too. Want to see that throughout the West Indies setup? Yeah, he's, it looks as though he's missed it and it hit it hit the back pad. Oh, it's a big appeal, but oh, McCallum goes bang up and over cover. Good use of the feed and picks up a well-needed boundary. Swept. It's a top edge that's going to run away fine for four. McCallum lost his balance, but he put... Up and over. Not enough on that. Jimmy Nisham, not sure it was. In the air. Wow, what a catch that is. That is brilliant from Bravo. Yeah, looked pretty clean for mine. In the air. No problem at all there. Darren Bravo gets the fingers underneath it. Oh, pulled away. What a shot that is. And that will go for four.
And it's 50 for Brendan McCullough. 50 from 55. A standout performance on the list today. Long way down the wicket. Hit very close. And they want him to get it. And they'll get a review straight away. McCullough a long way down. Front foot will be fine. It has been all day. Remember, it has to totally miss the stumps. Impact is in line. It goes with the on-field call. He'll have to go. Yeah. Oh, that's beauty. That is a ripper. The quicks like, look, it's like that, and the medium quicks like him too. Duggan short, straight at Mills's right shoulder. He couldn't get out of the road of it. Those safe hands of Darren Sammy. Bang, over the top, nicely shoveled away. Does it go all the way? It's hard to tell. Yes, it does. Baxter, who was at the umpiring end, the bowling end, we want to take it. And it's just rolled Nathan McCullum up, and he's at a six. So mate. He's got to play like it's a power play. Has he got it far enough? You bet he has. Very strong wrist, Nathan McCullum. Just a flick. It's a short boundary. Straight up. And into the crowd. Almost. No one's sitting there, but it would have been. That was beautifully struck. McCullum picked it right. Got a little bit of length, and he decided to go bang down the ground. Bit hard for four. Found the gap. Just a little bit of room. McCullum broke. Yeah, that's good enough. Not perfectly hit, but perfectly placed with those men all up. This could be the end of it anyway. McCullum's hold out. Yes, he has down the backward square leg. So New Zealand have been rolled. Forget about the over eight. So the sorry tale began right from the start, really. Guptill and Ryder, so much expected. And Dwayne Bravo, the skipper, coming in with four for 44. He was a genuine strike weapon to the tour. Looked away very fine. Short boundaries. They get shorter, and it can't be stopped. Just pitched on off and hit middle and off. And oh, he's beaten first up. They're appealing. They don't think. It's an edge. Dropped it. Oh, it should have been taken. They've got to take those. Should have been swallowed. You can argue that it might have been that uncomfortable height to his right. Decides to try his luck now, and he tries it brilliantly. That is a magnificent shot. About Charles is that he stays in the moment. He was dropped the ball before. He tails out outside leg stump to the very next delivery. Over the top and away. Too much whip and put away. It's too good a player to bowl there too. enough did it swing back in yeah much better seam position and it was a beauty because it came back very late at Johnson Charles oh that's a lovely shot beautifully timed just flicked away from Bravo not hit it brilliantly good enough to pick up four exactly what you were looking for Kane Williamson takes the catch it looked very full Bravo swung at it couldn't keep it down Kane Williamson comfortable catch but he knows it means a lot high and hard what a shot it's taken by one of the ground staff you wouldn't guess they were 36 for three this is a special shot you're right it's Dwayne Bravo signature shot over cover Work to wait. That could be four as well. The timing is impeccable. Too fine. Nisham's lost his line again, so good shot. 
Then he goes the other way. It's too wide and punished. Close, very close indeed. Yep. Close enough, says Gary Baxter. And it looked a good shout. The skipper probably just clipping the bales. Where has it pitched? Oh, there you go. There you go. No problem at all. Shows how good my eyes are. Clean again. Oh, it's just snuck past leg stump. He was looking for Pfeiffer. Oh, that's a lovely shot. Delightful through the covers for four from Simmons. Oh, it's hit away hard. Picks a gap. Some work for the fielder to do. Can't get there. Answer. That's wow. Swatted down the ground. Has it gone all the way? It has. It's gone for six. Flat batted by Simmons. Edged and taken. Ross Taylor shrugs the shoulders and says, I'm not sure. Let's go upstairs and have a look. The ball that is clear. No problems with the no ball. Striker will just say, watch your shuffling, watch it how far across the stumps, and he's a long way across. He is a long way across the stumps. Oh, it's forward strong for four. It's a lovely way to get off the mark, and Darren Semi has made sure he... Bang! Don't even think about it. No half follies to Darren Semi. Oh. Down the ground. Ball from McLennigan. Bang. Oh, he's gone again, but this time he hasn't got all of it. Enough for four. Real. Magnificent. He is in belligerent mood, this fellow. Oh, that could race away for four leg boys. This will be a very close contest. Ball wins. He's been threatening to do something in there. Brendan McCullum, his ground fielding's been outstanding. Set. They've been taken in the big. Definitely carried the big motivation there as Mitch. Glorious. Another cover drive holder peels off. And this one will have the momentum to get to the rope. Sammy, this time over, mid off. And four more. Over the top, you cannot set a field there because it's six. Frustrating for Nishim on Edge, yes, indeed. Holders on his way. Another twist, indeed. Then you did right. An unlucky way for a batter to get out, really. New Zealand, they take the luck. Oh, gosh. They don't need 10 anymore. That's. Huge! That's 40 rows back. That's a statement there from Sammy. Bang! Fetch that. Oh, goodness me. Oh, that's the game. That is it. He's belted six and four, Darren Sammy, in, in an impressive fashion. Look at the captain. And the players in, yes. He's got the blade across the top of the shoulder. That's his signature. It's uh, all over pretty quick tonight. It's just a 20 to 9 local time, but the West Indies with 22 and a half overs to spare. And Mitch McLennigan, well, 5 for 58, yet 5 for on a one-day international. You've done an extremely good job. Or 156, 157 for 8. The West Indies have won this match here at Eden Park.